So within seconds, the bottom layer of water begins to warm. From gentle warming to rolling boil at first, the water molecules just move a little faster, raising the temperature slowly. You may see tiny air bubbles forming on the metal surface. These are dissolved gases escaping as the water warms. As the temperature climbs closer to 100 degrees Celsius, the bubbles grow larger, and soon the entire kettle seems alive with movement. When water reaches its boiling point, the liquid changes into gas. Large bubbles of steam rise rapidly, and the surface of the water roils and churns. This familiar rolling boil is the kettle's signal that the water is ready. The clever automatic switch, one of the most impressive parts of the kettle, is how it knows when to stop. Without an automatic shutoff, the water would keep boiling until it evaporated completely, which would be both dangerous and wasteful. The solution is the bimetallic thermostat built into the switch. This tiny device contains two 